What's up you guys, welcome to the Single Guy channel. I'm Lloyd and today we're gonna to be talking about visualizations here in this sunny, sunny San Francisco day. It's finally a good day so I can shoot some videos. So basically, what I wanna talk about is a way to cut down on the amount of time that it's gonna take for you to get good and actually help you get good in general. So if you don't know what visualizations are, visualizations are basically where you visualize, you picture, you imagine yourself, doing the thing that you want to do. Now, a lot of really successful people use this technique. Conor McGregor is one of them, Richard Branson's one of them, Walt Disney was one of them. They pictured their success before it had even happened. So what I mean by this is that Conor McGregor had already pictured himself wearing the UFC title belt. Richard Branson had already pictured himself owning Virgin. Uh, Walt Disney had already pictured Disney World even before it had been created. And that's what I want you guys to do when it comes to pickup, dating, or getting girls in general, is picture your success before it's even happened. And when I want you to picture your success, I want you to picture it as detailed as you possibly can. So one of the, when I was uh, doing this, and I still do use this technique, but I used it more when I was coming up, um, before I went out or maybe just in my downtime, I would picture my night. I would picture my night before it had even happened. And you know, at the time, I just wanted to bring home a girl or a hot girl. So I would picture how that would go down. I would picture down to the details of me doing my hair, what outfit that I would wear. I would picture uh, myself putting on the outfit, calling the lift. I would picture myself getting into the lift and going down to whatever bar. I would pick a specific bar that I knew uh, when I visualized this, an actual bar that I had been to. Then I would picture meeting up with one of my buddies or something like that, and then looking around and seeing what kind of girls were there, uh, and then picking a girl and then walking up and in introducing myself, saying something funny or doing just like a crazy opener or something silly like that. Um, then I would picture flirting with her, bantering with her a little bit, uh, and then taking her away from her friends, going to the bar where we could have some one-on-one -on -one time. Then I would picture myself getting physical with her, maybe giving her a little kiss, making her laugh, teasing her. Then I would picture taking her from the bar um, back to my place, from the lift, walking up the steps to my place, opening my door, bringing her in, and then taking off her clothes, and then I would, I would visualize having sex with her, okay? I would cover all the, all the, all the bases, every, all the steps that I needed to do to complete what I wanted to do. And that's what I want you guys to do, is to visualize exactly what you want, exactly how it's going to go down, how you think it would go down to accomplish your goals. Now, when you do this, you're not gonna be very good at visualizing it, if, especially if you've never done it. But as you go out more and more, you're gonna be able to visualize the different details better and sometimes you picture okay so so let's say you visualize walking up and talking to the girl and rather than it going exactly the way you visualized it she says something like oh well we're just having a girls night tonight or I'm um, sorry I'm good visualize those objections and then visualize how you would respond to them in like the most badass way possible or the best way that you can imagine so if she's like oh we're just having a girls night I'm like cool we're having a boys night why don't we all be friends <laughs> visualize yourself saying something funny saying something witty and that way when it happens to you even if your witty comment doesn't go doesn't go well or it's not the right thing to say you at least prepared yourself mentally for the objection and that way you don't really get thrown off when it does happen so as time goes on, your visualizations are gonna be getting better and better as you get better, and your visualizations, eventually right now, as I talk to you, my visualizations are almost perfect. I can almost picture exactly how it's going to go down when I go out at night and I bring home a girl because not only have I done it, but I pictured it in my mind so many times that I can handle whatever objections that are coming at me. And so this is a technique that you can use in order to, to get better faster, in order to get better in general. Because if you've never pictured yourself doing something, it's gonna be very hard for you to achieve it because you're just gonna be going out, you're gonna be kind of lost, you're not gonna know what to do. If something, somebody throws something at you that you're not prepared for, it's gonna, it's gonna throw you off. If you get a shit test, it's gonna throw you off. If, you, if anything happens, you're not gonna be prepared for it. But if you've already visualized it and you've already pictured it in your mind, then you're gonna be prepared for whatever gets thrown at you. You're gonna maintain your confidence and that's why visualizations work so well. So thanks a lot, you guys. Let me know what you thought about this video. If you made it to the end, consider subscribing. I come out with videos like this every single week. Thanks a lot and good luck out there.